Well, it looks like we're not getting the Red Dead Redemption remake that we were hoping for. We're going to take a look at two articles talking about this as we get ready to, for the return to Retro Gaming News. No camera today, I'm still trying to fix it, but we are going to still break down two articles talking about the disappointment that um, a lot of people are having. So this is, both articles are from IGN. Red Dead Redemption on PS4 and Nintendo Switch confirmed PSC games, PC gamers left hanging. This was written yesterday at 7.55 in the morning. Let's have a read. Red Dead Redemption and Zombie add-on Undead Nightmare are coming to PS4 and Nintendo Switch on, the, on August 6, 17. Rockstar has it down. Rockstar's 2010 Western Adventure, which only launched on PS3 and Xbox 360, is being ported to PS4 by N Switch by UK de developer Double Eleven Studios, with PlayStation 5 backwards compatibility supported. The port is not a remaster or a remake, but a conversion, according to Rockstar, and includes newly supported languages such as simplified and traditional Chinese, Korean, Polish, Brazilian, Portuguese, Russian, and Latin American Spanish. It costs $50 on a Nintendo eShop, a PlayStation Store with physical versions arriving October the 13th. The trailer is below, and actually, the trailer doesn't look that bad. It's actually pretty good. It looks it's good, as long as we skip the ad. New existing customers get the amazing actually, iPhone looks pretty, 14 pretty on interesting. And with Apple TV Plus included, you can catch but a lot of people were looking for a full-on remake. Apple TV Plus on us at T-Mobile. As you can see here, we have the trailer. My name's Last John Marston. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. I'm here to bring two men to justice. Oh. Bill Williamson. Javier Esquela. I know one thing, Senor Marston. That looks good. You have your own way. Perfect. <laughs> Force must be used. Find out where he's cowering. Your wife and son are doing well. Let's try to ensure things stay that way. <laughs> that is great. I'll get 17. So let's continue with the article. Rockstar gives no mention of PC or Xbox versions. Red Dead Redemption is already available on modern Xbox console via backwards compatibility with, with the original Xbox 360 version. However, the lack of a PC version, which Rockstar has never officially released, is sure to come as a disappointment. Red Dead Redemption introduces star, series star John Marston as he journeys across the American waste West and Mexico to track down the latest remaining members of the notorious Bander Ben Gang. The event of 2018's Red Dead Redemption 2 lead directly into the story of its predecessor. Red Dead Redemption on, PS on Nintendo Switch and PS4 also includes on that nightmare. The story expanded that these Morrison tried to survive the zombie horde. So that is the first article we're going to take a look at. The next one we're going to take a look at is how a lot of fans are disappointed. And also on IGN. This time written by Logan Plant. The headline reads, Red Dead Redemption fans protest release. They're calling overpriced, lacking new features. This is not the remake fans were hoping for. Let's begin. Red Dead Redemption clearly announced PlayStation and Nintendo Switch release could have been a cause for celebration among the game's dedicated committee team. But instead, fans are up in arms over today's news, yesterday. This morning, yesterday I should say, Rockstar revealed that 2010's Red Dead Redemption and its Under Nightmare expansion are coming to PS4 and Nintendo Switch on August 6, 17, with physical editions to follow on October 13. Rockstar is calling the port a conversion rather than a remaster or remake, and the company is charging $50 
for the erasure of the game. Red Dead Redemption players on social media are upset of how, about Red Dead Redemption's price, missing multiplayer, and lack of a place PSPC is released. It doesn't help rumor it doesn't help matters that rumors about a Red Dead Redemption remake have been flying over for weeks following following a fresh rating for the game in South Korea. Fans got their hopes up for a full blown remake with with many clamoring for a version that would put the original in line with Red Dead Redemption 2. It is similar matter that to how The Last of Us Part 1 is now visually similar Part 2. And as you can see here, um PYO I'm not gonna I'm not sure if it's being pronounced correctly. Pio said the following Red Dead Redemption what we wanted. Remake the map is diff is in RD R D R two already. Sixty FPS dual sense feature. Only current gen version PS five, Xbox Series, good PC. The ultimate version. What well, we got, 30 FPS port, no, no 60 FPS, not, no remake or remaster, Rockstar not carrying. There's more, but that's not, but that's not what Rockstar is delivering. It said fans are disappointed that Red Dead Redemption on PS4 and Switch appears to look very visually similar the original PS3 and Xbox 360 version. You know what? I agree now. Rockstar also did announce 60, 60 FPS support for a new for the new port, leading fans to believe that it will run at the original game 30 FPS. Problem became even more glaring when the community realized that Red Dead Redemption is already play playable on Xbox Series X and 4K. Which was quickly pointed out online, and as you can see here, in case you missed it, Red Dead Redemption runs at 4K on Xbox Series X and at 1440p on Xbox Series S via the um, Hikachi method. And as you can see here in the screenshot, you can see that it runs at four at 1440p. With the Xbox Series X. Thanks to the Xbox Series X and S more robust backwards compatibility with previous generations of Xbox, Red Dead Redemption has has been accessible on Microsoft's platforms for years. This new release is not coming to Xbox, but that's surely because the original 360 version it is available right now on Xbox Store. In addition, the $50 price tag, price tag attached to the new PS4 and Switch versions doesn't look great next to the 30 price tag on Xbox. Quote, I bought the Game of the Year edition for $10 to play at 4K on my Xbox One, on my One X. $50 for a simple port on a 13-year-old game is something else. One user wrote on Reddit. Really sad day when the top post on r slash Red Dead Redemption is don't buy Red Dead Redemption, quote, another wrote. The upcoming port is also skipping PC entirely, but Rockstar has not officially released Red Dead Redemption. Matt on Twitter says the following. The Red Dead Redemption remaster is the biggest disappointment in the over of the year. A direct port of the 13-year-old game with zero changes for fifty dollars. Uh, such a great game to such a great game to be mistreated so harshly and also and no PC release. Bag was fumbled hard. And that's a meme. I'm not gonna play it just in case of copyright. Fans are calling the port a quote cash grab, but one of the top posts today on subreddit really reading do not buy Red Dead Redemption if you want to, if you want a proper remake remaster, then don't buy this cash grab. The post points out the po the post points out that the port appears to lack significant graphical and FPS enhancements 
and is missing the original multiplayer mode. And of course, today's announcement also brought plenty of memes. As such, they joked of the fact that Red Dead Redemption is coming to a Nintendo platform for the first time. Uh, Red Dead Re um, Jake says on uh, Twitter, Red Dead Redemption on the Nintendo Switch. Uh, he has Kirby, the Nintendo, of course. Cowboy Kirby. Kirby even has his um boot ready. Um, uh, yeah, something like this is gonna happen. And that's the actual article. So that's how actually Kirby in the cowboy boot actually looks pretty cool. Not gonna cap, but the but the moral of the story for today is the fact that we're not getting a proper remake. We are getting a port. Or I should say a simple port, or should I say a quote uh what did they what word conversion? A uh, conversion. Yeah, yeah, let's see about that one folks. Here's my take on this. Definitely I, I'm happy for those who um want to see it on PS4 and um Nintendo Switch. But the problem is the way that the trailer looks, it looks pretty good, but the problem is the trailer is basically the PS3 version. <laughs> Just put it on the uh, PS4 for um for twenty dollars more. That's the problem with that. Another thing is they're missing multiplayer. I I dabbled a little bit in way back in the day, twenty ten, when the game came out. I actually have the game. I dabbled in the in the game. It's pretty fun. No cap. Or so that's good. But the multiplayer was missing from this is gonna be missing from this new one. Yeah. And the fact that you can play Xbox already on Xbox X and S being um backwards compatible, yeah. No wonder why fans are upset. And PC. Rockstar is not showing PC love for this Red Dead Redemption conversion. Yeah. Don't forget the PC people. That's it for today's article. I hope you guys enjoyed. I will be linking you guys to this article below and the other one as well. If you have any questions, let me know. And let me know what you guys think. Are you buying this, what they call, Red Dead Redemption conversion? I know you could call it a remake or a rematch, so I'm calling it a conversion. So let me know. See what you guys like. That's all for now. We'll see you guys in our next Retro Yuki Gaming News Report of the Day.